A Thousand Words on Race and Hope, Light for the World to See. I like this. This is a hardcover. So already I am liking this book. Let's look at the back here. In the tradition of James Baldwin's report from occupied territory comes light for the world to see. A rap session on race. A lyrical response to the struggles of black lives in our world, to America's crisis of conscience, conscience to the centuries of loss, endless resilience, and unstoppable hope. To support racial justice, the author and the publisher have made donations to the Equal Justice Initiative. There he is, Kwame Alexander, is the critical, critically acclaimed, award-winning New York Times best-selling poet and the author of over 35 books. Wow, okay, we have to take a quick look at this because I'm excited. Now, it is a hardcover. I'm not having a hard time keeping it open. It's a smaller book, but let's, let's look at the contents. Oh, I like that. I like how it's on two pages. That's cool. Good work, Kwame. I hope I'm saying his name right. Nice. Very, very nice. The contents. Freedom Now. In Brooklyn, New York, on the morning of November 7th, 1978, as I got ready for school, my father, the principal, informed me that the entire student body would be marching over the Brooklyn Bridge into Manhattan to protest the police killing of Arthur Miller, a Crown Heights black civic leader. My first reaction was fear. I cried as my classmates and I shakily, shakily marched across the Hudson River along narrow streets lined with supporters and policemen. Wow, wow, what, what an experience, right? I, I can't even begin to imagine. Wow, look at that, that's cool. We can't speak out your name. We can't keep our tongue, we can't learn to read. We can't shield our girls. We can't save our sons. We can't hold our own, we can't bend a knee, we can't take a stand. We can't hold a gun, we can't stop that whip, we can't wear this skin. We can't save ourselves, we can't hang ourselves. We can't breathe, yeah. Great book. Again, the author of this book is the very famous Kwame Alexander. I like it. Take care.